In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to download the stickers file from the Future ADHD website and import it to your GoodNotes app on your iPad. So the first step is that you're going to download the sticker zip file to your iPad. The second step is that you're going to locate that zip folder and unzip it. You're going to move those uh, images to your Photos app. And the final step is you're going to open GoodNotes and import the stickers into the GoodNotes app. So the first step is to download the sticker zip file. So you're just going to tap here and you'll see that the download option appears at the bottom here and you need to actually tap download to start that process. And um, depending on your internet speed, it may take a little bit longer, but there are 140 images and they're not too large. So it should only take a few minutes. Just make sure that the progress bar completes fully so that you get all 140 images or stickers, as we call them, um, on your iPad. So that one's almost done. Okay, and now I just need to tap open in and save it to my files. So I'll just tap here like this. And now I need to select where I'm going to save it. So make sure that you um, remember where you save the files to. So you can either create a new folder or um, I already have a folder called planners. So I'm going to put, save the stickers in that folder. Okay, and now I can exit out of my web browser app and I'm gonna open my uh, files folder on my iPad and locate where I saved that zip file. So I can see it in the top left corner here, stickers 2.0 zip file. So when I double tap that, you can see that a new stickers folder has opened here. So if when I tap in here, I will see all of the sticker images. And if I scroll to the bottom, I can see that there are 140 items, which means all the stickers have downloaded. So now I need to get these stickers from that folder onto my Photos app. So the way that I do that is I tap select in the top right hand corner. Then I tap select all in the top left corner. And then I go down to the share button here in the bottom left corner. Apple likes to make these things a little bit tricky. Thank you, Apple. And I'm going to save the 140 images by tapping this button and they will go straight into my photos app. So like that. And then I can close this app and just double check by going into my photos app. Yep, all of those images have just come in. Great. So now I go into my GoodNotes app and this is the final step. So stick with me, you're doing great. Okay, so I'm in the GoodNotes app and I need to um, just go and find a page um, that I want to insert the stickers to. So you can see I've already got one on here, um, but it can be any page in the planner so I can pop it on this page. And I'm gonna tap the annotation tool here to bring up the whole menu bar. And the stickers um, is this icon here. And if you have just started using GoodNotes, chances are it'll, it'll, you'll be using one of these functions, the pen tool, and you'll just need to tap the stickers icon twice to get the toolbar here to, to appear. And in order to, you can see that I've already got my stickers imported. And when you look inside this toolbar, you can see probably that there are some automatic sticker options that come with GoodNotes, but you can add your own. So, um, you just scroll all the way to the right along this bottom toolbar and the, click the plus button. And now you can see that you can start a new stickers collection. So to do that, you can just um, call that whatever you'd like. I like to name mine by the year, like that. And now I need to add the photos by tapping this add photos button in the bottom left. And doing it with a finger is best at this point. So I'm just going to hold and drag my finger and just drag it down like this to select all of the images. And then I can tap add. And then I can create the new collection and you can see that it's just loading all the images in. Okay, and now I have my 2023 sticker collection saved in there. So if I want to add a sticker to a page, I just select it from there and I can resize it like that. And they're all saved in there for me. 
and they can if you're using the same sort of same ones every time and you have some favorites you'll also notice that those ones appear up here so so you can kind of just grab them from up in this toolbar or if you want other ones you just tap in here and scroll down to choose and that's how you use the stickers in the GoodNotes app.